Hey guys, this is iMaster, and today I'm going to be talking to you about the free online service Picnic, which allows easy online photo editing. Alright, let's get into it. So, open up Safari and go to Picnic.com. That's P I C N I K.com. And you get this home page, and like I said, I think I said it's free. So you would just click get started now. And it comes up with a loading bar. Um, unfortunately, this is not an application that you can buy or download really because it's free. I, I wish it was, but it's not. So it says hello guest you can create an account sign in you can register um, but you don't have to do any of that so you can upload your own photo to edit or use a demo photo I'm just gonna go ahead and use one of their demo photos like this leaf one right here and it'll say downloading give you a little progress bar okay so then we get the photo so we're in the edit tab now so we can just edit the photo in general so we can crop it let's focus on this leaf let's say okay we can resize edit the exposure a little bit Okay, doesn't look great, but you know, colors, um, you know, all the basic photo editing stuff. You can sharpen it. All right, so once you're done with that, you can go on to the create tab. This is where you really get a lot more options. You can add effects. Now, a lot of these are for premium only. Now, premium is you pay for it, um, so you get more effects if you pay for it. Things such as um, black and white are available, boost, soften, vi vignette, matte, infrared, all these great effects down here are available without the premium. Now, let's go ahead and say I like the pencil sketch that could be cool all right so it gives it turns our image into a nice pencil sketch so uh, I don't really like that so I can cancel and let's see I'll pick puzzle nope that's premium um how about boost let's see what that does okay that's kind of nice so we can See, it gives us a brush size so that we can only boost certain areas if we want to. And what I'm doing is unboosting the what we're focusing on. So lots of really, really nice effects. You can add text to it. It's asking me if I want to apply the effect that just put it. Um... So let's say I like the impact font. We can type in text. Click add. Okay, I master 33. Make it green. Adjust the fade, you know, if you want to like watermark it. The size. Okay. We can add stickers. You know, they're just what they say. They're stickers. We can add little picnic, um, little photo licenses. Let's say copyright. Okay, stuff like that. It's it's a really fun thing to just mess around with. You can add a frame to it. Uh, let's say border. Okay. I'll apply that. And 
just tons of effects. This is another set of effects. Uh, smudge. Okay, like as before, it gives us our brush so we can unsmudge what we want to unsmudge. Go to our advanced tab. Curves. Just really, really great stuff, guys. Oh, that's a premium feature. But, so once you're done editing your photo, you can come to save and share. You can save it as whatever you want. Um, it recommends JPEG, but it has PNG, GIF, bitmap, PDF, TIFF, whatever. Compression, you can change the compression, dimensions, and then save photo. So it's an overall really great program. You might want to check it out if things like GIMP, Photoshop isn't really what you need. You just need a simple photo editor. Uh, this is free. That's why I like it. You know, I love everything free. So, guys, thanks for watching. Rate, comment, subscribe. See you later. Bye.